sneaking around is back in the house today, 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 today. Yes, today we have Pair Linux OS 7, or Pair OS 7. Yeah, based on Ubuntu, but with a different look and feel. We're using GNOME in the background, as you see, GNOME 3, number 3. Right, this is a fully installed, and it's probably the last one I'm going to do on this single core machine I've got here, because they're getting a bit older than new stuff now, really. But I thought, well, yeah, give it a good go before it goes out, it's the last one I've got. So anyway, it runs reasonably well, considering, yeah, considering, on dual core machine and quad cores, shoom, wow, really, really fast. This one, mediocre, but hey, I'm going to show you anyway. Uh, I had a couple of problems with the drivers, selecting the correct driver for my card, I've got an NVIDIA card in here, but once I got that one sorted out, it was quite fine, sneaky and dandy. Oh yes indeedy, super duper. Anyway, what do you get? Well, no free in it for a start. Okay, so you get all the stuff up the top. There's my hard drive, my trash. Welcome to Pair OS and network servers. You can actually remove all them if you so wish to do so. On your little Mac inspired bar down the bottom here, we have our finder, which is a file finder basically. There you go. So there's my stuff. Nice and easy, super duper, lovely jubbly. We have a launch pad here. There is keyboard shortcuts for it as well, by the way. They're not just there all the time, okay? You can use well, Most of the time you're using your uh, super key, as they call it, or the old dozy key, or the Windows key. As you can see, there's plenty installed, but we'll come back to that in a momento, okay? Next, we have Geary Mao for your Mao. We have On Air for music. Now, it looks very, 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 very similar to some of the other stuff out there, okay? I've not actually put any music on it at the moment, so hey, ho, so you okay? What does it actually look like? I can't is it? It's not X noise, is it? It's, it's, it's another one of those. Anyway, you got some preferences here over here for your music stuff. Where's the location? Keep your music folder organised. Last FM, you have to pay for now without all bleeding ads. Yeah, okay. So that's that out of the way. Don't forget the off button or the get rid of button is over there. Okay. We have VLC Media Player as your default media player for Vidvos, which is not a bad choice, really. There we go. Comes up. That's what it says on the tin. Nice. Super duper. Firefox is your default browser of choice. Of course, it would be, wouldn't it? Yes. Now, in theory, okay, in the just notes I said in theory, if I go straight to Google, uh, <clears throat> Flash is installed by default. So what we're going to do is go straight to the tube while we're here, as our clicky, clicky, clicky. Sorry about the tiny delay we've got here, but it is an old machine. I'm going to try and waz the most out of it before I get rid of it, okay? So... Put me in, sneak in the next one, just make sure it all plays oakley doakley. We'll just quickly click on there to make sure the vidvos run correctly, which they do. I have checked it, it does work. I'm not going to be go up a size or anything, I'm just showing you now. Once the advert gets out of the way, don't you just hate adverts sometimes? Yeah, but pay some of the bills sometimes, don't they? Anyway, here it comes, sneaky Linux. That's me. I'll just forward up to that one there. There we go. It's playing away, super duper, does what says on tin. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, that's it out of the way. See you later. We also have time back. Now you can make your own backups. It's their own little utility. Well, I think it's I've been out there a while, but hey. So you've got a USB hard drive or whatever, or another partition on the drive you've got in the machine. We can check that out for you. Okay, so that's nice. There's also a little thing up here that does that as well. I'll do that in a minute. Right, the thing I wanted to show you more than anything else was pair utilities, okay? A pair utility. Here we have my pair, okay? So we're going to go and check out my pair first. No, I don't mean that. Don't be rude, yes. So here you can check out your desktop. So you can have all your icons on the desktop if you want to. System font size, desktop font size, okay? The second one down is your dock. Now mine's at default on the bottom, but you can push it on the right or the left or wherever you want to. You can have it to auto hide, intelli hide, hidey hidey hide, whatever you want. Show your clock, show your seconds, yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't have to have them if you don't want to in the panel up here, okay? You don't have to have them if you don't want to. Remember, it's basically known three at the end of the day. Works a bit better. Now, here's your shortcut corners, okay? I actually haven't set any at the moment. So, up the top there, we have launch pad or none. You can have what you want. You know, I've not actually set any. I'm just showing you. Don't shoot me, man. We get the information. You can have your little things pop up wherever you want to. And finally... You can check out your logout menu, shutdown menu. You can have them hide or not hide. And you can optimise your system. I mean, if you've got 8 to 12 gig of RAM, you can speed up your system by avoiding the swap file. So if I just say, you can have no swap file at all, have it all in RAM or nothing, okay? It's entirely up to you, okay? Yeah, I thought you'd like that one. Anyway, back to pair utilities. We have clean my pair. Oh yeah, I'm cleaning my pair. 
Because if you use a cleanup, that's all that. Yeah, thumbnails, Firefox cache, flash player cache, temporary files, just gets rid of them for you. A nice little cleanup utility. Although there are plenty out there anyway for you to use. And you can check out the root chat, you're going to clear it all out, just chuck it in the bin, can't you? Yeah, of course you can. And one more time, down to pair utilities, is the pair PPA manager. Now, I was going to put uh, Volco screen on to record it, but I, what I've done, I just put record my desktop one. For now, that's what it says, isn't it? I might do that a bit later. If I keep it on the machine, I'll probably put about three more OSs on here before I finish with it, and then I think it's time to go, and I'll strip it out, and bye-bye. Okay, after pair utilities, we have the system settings, which is the usual. You know what it is. It does what it says on Letting, okay? The usual. Now, it's all here. You know what it is, so I haven't got to show you any more. Have I really? No. Anyway, up here, as you can see, as I said before, you can configure your backup policies for backing up. And you can restore files if you so wish to do so. Let's record my desktop, which I'm using at the moment. If I click on here, about this computer. So we're going to click on there, and we can see what computer I'm using to do this little screencast here for you. As you can see, there's the overview. Pair Linux 7, that's me, sneaky pair. <laughs> as you can see, got an NVIDIA graphics card in here, so that's fine. It's Pentium 4. Not, it's not a dual core, it's hyper threaded. Don't let them fool you on that. Your default applications you can change to whatever you want to. So, if you want to put Chrome on, you can. Obviously, you've got them just defaults here. I mean, I've been playing it for a little while. Ruble Media, yeah, what to do, run software, blah, blah, blah. And graphics, it's the GeForce 620. It's one of the real cheap ones. I always keep the cheapos handy because the onboard graphics just don't, still don't cut it. They should have checked it out by now, shouldn't they, really, when you think about it? Yeah. I put that in the corner there, and that goes. Notice all my icons go. Yeah, with them. Obviously, they come back at some stage. But one again, there's all the other desktops, the little shortcuts there, so you can go to a different desktop and go that again. Go back to the original one. Lovely. All done. So we're going to go welcome to pair. Hello, welcome to pair. Right, welcome to pair OS 7. Tells you all about your new system. So we've got launch pad, tells you what it's all about. Machine control, tells you what it's all about, what you do. Desktop switcher, I've showed you all these before. Clean my pair, I just showed you all that. My pair for, I know what I mean. Notification center, you know what I mean. I was getting on a sing song there, wasn't I? Well, that's rather nice, isn't it? It does work. It's quite nice to use. I wouldn't use it on this machine permanently, to be really honest. It's one of my test machines that I do screencasting on. Because you know me, I like to do a bit of full install sessions. Yeah, put a bit of your SD sessions and stuff like that. Yeah. Anyway. Apart from that, we're about the fox again. We need his eyes open up. There we go. So I'm just going to type in pair Linux. Probably not quite a thing in it, but hey. We need his to work. Pair Linux, it's from France, as you all know. Bonjour. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. And when it decides to come up, dun, dun, dun. this is why I wouldn't use it on this sort of machine. It will work, don't get me wrong. It will work, but it won't be as quick as it could be. Go to the home, tells you a bit more about it. When the server decides to kick in, there. So yeah. Come on, server, kick in. Well, that's basically it. Okay. Download section we'll go to. I'll show you where we are and where we're at and where you can get it from. It's 64 bit, remember, please. 64 bit. Come on, the French servers. Hurry up, that's better. There we go. Pair OS 7, this is the one we're using. It's nice. I got it okay from the UK um, mirror. It was fine, done in a couple of minutes, really. Oh, no, no big deal. Lovely. I oh, hope you get a pair of stickers. Do you want a pair of stickers? Let's see what the pair of stickers are like. I just want to see. Oh, that's not. 60, is that 60 cents? Yeah, 60 cents or 45 cents. Yeah, maybe, maybe not. Not really what I do, really, is it? No. Anyway, pair Linux. I just thought I'd give you a quick look at it to see what it's all about. And it's rather nice. Nicey, nicey. I could go into it more, but I'm not going to. I may do it another time. But hey, got more div stuff to do, more DVDs to do, more distros to look at. Oh yeah, sneaky Linux going out. I see you later. Bye-bye.